the Bible to the cross from the cross. Every Bible story has three components. First, God's law. Second, God's compassion. Third, God's miracle. Opening your Bible opens miracles. The Bible as one story is holy enough in our lives. Day 31, Exodus 35 to 38. The one out blueprint of architecture plan. The people of Israel cheerfully gave their precious possessions for the tabernacle to be built according to the pattern God gave them. First point. The first step to your body is the temple of Christ is established with the construction of the moving tabernacle. Through the whole Bible, we can see how the moving tabernacle conducted by Moses at Mount Sinai, which was used for 500 years, was converted into the 1,000-year Jerusalem temple orchestrated by David and Solomon. This was finally completed by Jesus on the cross. God, through Jesus' cross, made all those believe in him the temple of Christ. The first step to God's wonder was the 500 years of the moving tabernacle. For this project, Bezalel and Oholia were given the job, and they managed to complete their task without a single mistake. And he has filled him with the Spirit of God, with wisdom, with understanding, with knowledge, and with all kinds of skills to make artistic designs for work in gold, silver, and bronze, to cut and set stones, to work in wood, and to engage in all kinds of artistic crafts. He has filled them with skill to do all kinds of work as engravers, designers, embroiderers in blue, purple, and scarlet yarn, and fine linen, and weavers, all of them skilled workers and designers. Itama furthermore checked the final details. Wise people among the nation also collaborated. Second point, even during the construction of the Holy Tabernacle, it was important to keep the bath. The construction of the tabernacle lasted approximately six months. During that time, there were around 25 days of Sabbath. Even during the holy construction of the tabernacle, God commanded the Israel nation to keep the Sabbath. For six days, work is to be done. But the seventh day shall be your holy day. A day of Sabbath lasts to the Lord. Whoever does any work on it is to be put to death. Do not light a fire in any of your dwellings on the Sabbath day. Third point. Bezalel and Oholiab studied the design sheet given by God to make the tabernacle so many times that it became tattered. Bezalel and Aholia were given the design of the tabernacle by God from Moses, and it was their job to complete it. They studied it so thoroughly that it would have become tattered. This was because the tabernacle was God's own creation and was to be a holy place. Fourth point. The reason we make an offering is to understand something greater. Before leaving Egypt, God ensured that the Israel nation took with them a generous amount of compensation from the Egyptians for their slavery. The Israel nation, with their accumulated goods, made two willing offerings. The first was in order to make the golden calf and the second was in order to make the tabernacle. God commanded for the entire Israel nation to make an offering so that they could contribute to the tabernacle. Fifth point, 
the six months in Egypt and the six months in Mount Sinai was a joyful time of walking. The final six months in Egypt was a joyful time for the Israel nation as they were able to see God doing work for them. The first six months on Mount Sinai was a joyful time for God to see the Israel nation working hard for him. God worked ferociously for the Israel nation leading up to and during Exodus. Through the ten plagues and also by splitting the Red Sea in half, God showed everyone who he was. But approximately six months later, God was able to sit back and enjoy witnessing the Israel nation work wholeheartedly to carry out his vision. The Israel nation was able to offer to God the gift of giving. Indeed, the joy of giving is so much bigger than the joy of receiving. I am thrilled that you have downloaded the Tondoc app. The Tondoc app is not like any other app in the world today as well as in the body of Christ today. Dr. Biyongo Zhou has devoted his entire life to teaching men and women like yourself to understand the entirety of the Word of God as a masterful and beautiful story from Genesis to Revelation. Dr. Zhou is a sought-after speaker worldwide. He's a cutting-edge pastor and leader. He is a renowned theologian and a prolific writer. And you're going to be equipped and energized like never before to understand and apply the Word of God into your life. Again, thank you for downloading the Tondoc app.